Hey, what is up, guys? I am the newest Secreta TV director, and my name is Chico Oil Rider. And today I'm going to be talking to you about something very important as a commentator, and it, that is how to improve and produce quality videos on, uh, like, at a regular basis, and how to do well. So the the key to being successful as a YouTube commentator is first quality because if you don't have good quality people don't want to just look at a camera pointed at a TV even if you got like quadruple moabs and you're just like wrecking everyone people don't want to see that people would rather see someone go like 25 and 10 than see a camera pointed at a TV that's just the honest fact so quality mic quality PBR that's the key stuff now let's get into more depth more d what we need to do next is make sure you know what you're doing. Like, do you want to be a Call of Duty commentator? Do you want to talk about Minecraft? Do you want to talk what do you want to talk about? You have to have a focus on your channel. I usually talk about things that are on my mind, topics that are relevant, and usually just talk about nothing during Minecraft and just ramble on about something people might want to hear about. So, honestly, you just have to talk to people, be interactive. Next the thing to growing your channel is you have to interact with other people. You can't do it by yourself. That's almost impossible. No one can do it. Everyone has help from somewhere. You just have to grow and work with other people. In the beginning, I was able to get onto a fairly large network that had over 2,500 subscribers, and that got me off, got me started. I was then able to get onto a network similar to Zucreta, which then helped me grow even more. So. I'm almost the size as Zucreta TV, which is really awesome. I'm not trying to brag or anything, but honestly, you just have to work with people, trying to find a community channel. And guys, remember, you have to have realistic standards here. You can't just think you're going to get 100 subscribers the first week that you're going to be on here. I know I've been on YouTube for only a month now, and I have over 400 subscribers, which is insane, but... I've had a lot of luck and a lot of things go my way. When I've contacted people, they've always come to, came back to me with a positive response. So remember, just have realistic standards when you're attempting to be a commentator on YouTube because there's so many of them. It's so hard to be successful and it's just a really ch big challenge to do well. So, Also guys, another important thing is make your content on other channels extreme quality because when I post my channels I know it's my subscribers and they're usually pretty active and they usually like most of my content so but when you're posting to a community channel you have to post something that people will want to see people want to watch it's important to appeal to a wider audience that's why I always like to open out on a bigger channel about something either a story or something about commentaries to do well and improve because I know I might not be the best commentator but I know I'm well spoken and I've done well on YouTube at least for well well in terms of just being somewhat of a channel that has somewhat of a following guys but Honestly, besides knowing what you are and getting yourself out there and working with others, there's also important things you have to do. And that's the way you speak. You have to be enthusiastic. You always have to speak clearly. And even if you mispronounce something, I usually either cut it completely out or start the whole commentary over again. Because, honestly, no one wants to hear you stuttering around, just talking, being like Mr. Like Whisper something. Because, honestly... People don't want to hear people butcher the English language. It's just not what people want to see. Also, guys, let's get on to the terms of gameplay. Gameplay is not the biggest deal because I don't focus my channel on gameplay. But the majority of my gameplays, almost all of them, have above a 5 KD and are entertaining to watch. The majority of my that I've posted to my channel recently have been 10 to 15 KD gameplays. But honestly, guys... You don't have to be a great Call of Duty player to be a great Call of Duty commentator. The only Moabs I've ever gotten were in Infected. But I'm a great free-for-all player. I win almost every free-for-all match I join in at the very beginning when I'm actually playing aggressively. So, guys, you just have to try your best, have decent gameplay, and be enthusiastic. And the next thing is, you really, really have to work hard at what you do. You can't just always take a first take honestly guys because my last commentary I put on my channel that took seven takes and it wasn't even that great 
guys. I know I'm sounding pessimistic here, but you guys have to work for what you have. You have to work to produce great quality. Wow. But I'm still going to keep that because I'm on a roll right now. But guys, you have to work hard at what you do. You can't expect immediate success. And also, guys, contact others. Work with people. I know you guys might want to contact the person with 1,000 subscribers or 500. But honestly, guys, a lot of them don't want to have much to do with you because honestly you're just one person with maybe a small subscriber base you have to try to find people your size and guys i'm very supportive of my of my subscribers i will retweet your videos i will like your videos favorite them so they show up on my feed but i can't give all of you guys shout outs so that's just the way things work i love supporting people and you just have to find those people that like supporting people like working with you like i have a person who i work with a lot and he's like a quarter of the size of my channel but I work with him because he's an awesome guy just because he just hasn't had as much success as me doesn't mean I'm not gonna work with him on YouTube so guys just just key things I mean it's gonna list them off here great quality which means PVR or something similar to it great mic enthusiastic commentary you have to work with others try joining community channels try working with others and just try to do your best in what you make you have to be proud of what you produce if you're not proud of what you're producing people aren't gonna be thoroughly entertained by what you're doing so I want to thank you guys all for watching thanks for having me on Zucredit TV and I'm out